Welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to calculate the ground state energy of linear harmonic oscillator as a con consequence of Heisenberg's uncertainty principle. Or we know what is Heisenberg's uncertainty principle. It states that we cannot simultaneously specify the position and movement of, of a microscopic particle at, with ultimate accuracy. Also, this principle is valid to uh, conjugate variables like energy and time, angular momentum and angle. In this case, in order to calculate the ground state energy of linear harmonic oscillator, we are going to consider the position momentum uncertainty principle. For a linear harmonic oscillator, uh, we are considering one dimensional case. The total energy E is the sum of kinetic and potential energies, kinetic energy plus potential energy. For one dimensional linear harmonic oscillator, it is equal to kinetic energy P square by 2m plus potential energy half k x square where k is given in terms of angular velocity as uh, omega equal to root k by m. So, it is equal to p square by 2m plus half m omega square x square. And the position momentum uncertainty principle is delta x into delta p approximately equal to h goes by in order to simplify the problem, we are taking the uncertainty in position delta x approximately equal to x and uncertainty in momentum delta p approximately equal to p. So, we can replace p by delta p and x by delta x in the equation for total energy. So, E equal to, equal to uh, delta p square by 2m plus half m omega square delta x square. From the uncertainty principle, delta x into delta p approximately equal to x cross by 2, we can write delta p approximately equal to h cross by 2 delta x. Now we can substitute the value of delta p in the equation for total energy as E equal to h cross by 2 delta x whole square divided by 2m plus half m omega square delta x whole square. Simplifying, simplifying we get E equal to h cross square divided by 8m delta x square plus half m omega square delta x square. We know that the ground state energy is the minimum energy available to the linear harmonic oscillator. So, for the case of minimum energy or for the minimum, we can write dE by d of delta x equal to 0. So, differentiating the above equation, we get h cross square divided by 8m into minus 2 by delta x whole cube plus half m omega square into 2 delta x equal to 0. That, that implies minus h cross square divided by 4m delta x cube plus m omega square delta x equal to 0. Okay. Multiplying throughout by delta x whole cube, we get minus h cross square divided by 4m plus m omega square delta x whole raised to 4 equal to 0 or in this equation of m omega square delta x whole raised to 4 equal to h cross square divided by 4m. That 
that implies delta x whole raised to 4 equal to delta x whole raised to 4 equal to h cross square divided by 4 m square omega square or delta x whole square equal to taking only the positive root h cross divided by 2 m omega delta x whole raised to Delta x whole raised to 4 equal to h cross square divided by 4 m m square omega square. So we obtained delta x whole raised to 4 equal to h cross square divided by 4 m square omega square or delta x equal to h cross divided by 2 m omega whole raised to this implies delta x equal to h cross square divided by 4 m square omega square whole raised to 1 by 4 that is equal to here h cross square by 4 m, m square omega square itself is a square. So delta x equal to h cross by 2 m omega whole raised to half. Now we can substitute this value of delta x in the expression for energy, total energy. So E equal to equal to uh, in the previous case we obtained it is equal to h cross square divided by 8 m into delta x whole square plus half m omega square delta x whole square so it is equal to h cross square divided by 8 m into delta x equal to h cross by 2 m omega whole raised to half. So it is equal to 8 m into h cross divided by 2 m omega plus half m omega square into h cross by 2 m omega. It is equal to equal to h cross h cross will cancel omega will come mm, equal to 1 by 4 h cross omega plus 1 by 4 h cross omega is equal to half h cross omega. So the ground state energy ground state energy of Ground state energy of linear harmonic oscillator, one dimensional linear harmonic oscillator is equal to half h cross omega. It is a consequence of Heisenberg's uncertainty principle. Uh, here we used the Heisenberg's uncertainty relation to calculate the ground state energy of the one dimensional linear harmonic oscillator.